what's going on welcome back to the channel uh, today is going to be a quick video on an update for the DJI fly app version of 1.4.2 there has been uh, a few things uh, updated so we will go over that in a minute so I'm in my backyard and I'm just going to uh, launch from my deck and show you exactly what was updated So what's new on this app? Uh, it added a connection guide for the DJI FPV uh, to check uh, how to connect to the FPV. And then also it adds uh, a color display assist when using D-Log to check the color effects directly in the camera view for your DJI Air 2S. And also it fixes uh, certain issues and optimizes overall app quality. So right now I am filming in the normal color profile now if I were to go into my menu and go into the camera control and then uh, switch over to D-Log, it gives me an option to uh, add color display assist. So right now you can see the color is flat and there's not much vibrance in it or anything. There's no saturation or anything. Uh, so if I go back into the menu and click on the color assist, now you can see there's a little color added to it, but you're still filming in D-Log. So this is pretty much just a preview to show, um, to show you how it looked with some color in it. Um, I really don't use uh, D-Log as much as I should. I need to start using it. Um, I need to also start learning how to color correct. So uh, this is very, this could be useful uh, for those who uh, use D-Log more often. And here's a side by side. So there was another thing that was added that wasn't listed and I'm going to bring this down and show you. As of right now, this is detecting obstacles that are in front of me right now. As you can see, I'm going, you can see the yellow bars or orange bars right there up in front. I turned off the beeping so you wouldn't be able to, so it won't annoy you. So it's detecting these, this tree right here in front of me. And now as I start pushing forward towards this other tree and going underneath, you can see this, uh, the indicator right here up in the center of the screen indicating the clearance distance between the drone and uh, the tree. Uh, it's pretty useful. Gives you an idea of how much clearance you have definitely if you're uh, trying to do like a pass through or something like that. I'm going to do it again. And it seems to be pretty accurate. All right, guys. So uh, yeah, that was about it. Um, there's a quick update on the um, the DJI Fly app uh, version 1.4.2. There's a couple things in there for the uh, DJI Air 2, Air 2S, and I uh, hope you found that useful. Um, this is available on iOS and Android. However, on Android, you will have to go to the DJI Download Center and download it from there. All right, so if you enjoyed this video and found it useful, please give it a big thumbs up. And also, if you like this type of content, if you like tips, tricks, tutorials, and cinematic videos, uh, please uh, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you know the next time I post a video. Uh, but until next time, guys, you fly safe, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.